Hello, hello. I'm in downtown and I wanted to catch Jesse vlogging. Vlogception. <laughs> so uh, we just went to Rezana and we got some tea and we were planning to shoot here in Fulton but nothing is striking our fancy so we're gonna go shoot somewhere else. But um, it is a nice day at least. The weather is good. I would have ideally liked to shoot in between that sign, the Fresno sign, but there are cars parked all along it. Did you say hi? Yo. Hi. What up, though? No, I'm just kidding. I'm sorry. Hi. <laughs> That's Where the party at? That... <laughs> <laughs> if only you guys had heard that conversation oh earlier. We were talking about um, cat calling and how some guys are trying to holler, and then it turns out they were just trying to sell phones and. Oh no, we got hit on. Don't oh well, we did it. the first time, yeah. but then the second time it was like, "Hey, you want a free phone?" I'm like, nah, I'm good, thank uh, you. I got my phone. I'm good. <laughs> anyway, um, we just finished shooting our outfits. Jesse got a two-in-one, mm -hmm. and look at her. This is a little preview for you guys. Boom, 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 boom. Shoe twins. <laughs> Yay! Oh, yeah. So now we're gonna go get something to eat because we're both we starving, hungry. like I didn't Marvin. Eat yet. At all. At all. Oh, girl. The only thing I've had today was that tea. Just walking in Old Town. Such a nice day today. Look how pretty. If you guys ever visit the area, come to Old Town. So charming and cute. There's brick everywhere. That's where we filmed the video down there. <laughs> well, was that? That was like last year, Valentine's like around, Yeah, yeah. Valentine's, huh? We filmed one right there. And down there. Right and there. over there in that corner. Yep. What is this place called? Old House Bistro? I think so. I think the, yeah, the Old House Bistro, something like that. We decided to come here for lunch because the place we wanted to go to originally was closed. But I think, like Justy said before I started filming, it worked out because we got this really cute setup. I got a Waldorf, Waldorf, mm -hmm. Waldorf, sorry. Waldorf. I have trouble saying my R's. Waldorf chicken salad and it smells and tastes amazing. The seafood melt, which has like shrimp and okay. crab and melted cheese and spinach. Looks delicious. Mm -hmm. it tastes delicious. With the salad and mm -hmm. tea. How cute is that? I want to take that home. It's mm -hmm. royal wedding tea. Yes, got home just in time to watch the Pretty Little Liars season finale. I'm so excited. Who is A? Oh my god, this is me freaking out during the last five minutes of the show. What the heck? Are you serious? Who the heck is Charles? Is Charles Allie's brother? Okay, I don't know how I'm feeling about this. What? <laughs> freaking pretty little lot. I'm on my way to the bay what what yeah so um youtube is having this thing called youtube creator day it takes place tomorrow which is a thursday and i'm going with my girl cora i'm actually crashing at her house tonight and tomorrow so we can go together and it's gonna be awesome it's gonna be an amazing experience we'll get to check out the youtube headquarters um meet other youtubers we're gonna learn a lot of stuff about growing our channel and it's it's gonna be cool I'm really excited I was telling DC earlier that I'm a little bit nervous because I was looking over the agenda and towards the beginning of the day there will be icebreakers and I dread icebreakers I like especially in college you know that first day or the first couple days you do icebreakers in groups or as a whole class and they always made me really nervous really awkward I had this mentality that no one was gonna want to talk to me because I'm fat um, and I guess that still kind of lingers on because I'm feeling that anxiety as I think about icebreakers for tomorrow but um I'm gonna get through it, I'm gonna soldier on. It's probably not that big of a deal as I'm making it seem in my head. What is this spot called? Oh, this is Merritt College. Oh, okay. Yeah. So they brought me up here. This is so beautiful. 
need to zoom in so I can show you guys. Good morning guys, Cora and I made it to YouTube. Do you want to say hello? Hello! Look at her amazing hair, it's beautiful. Only There's it some good lighting for your hair. It stinks though. <laughs> like, do you ever have your hair dyed and then it like stinks the next day? Well, mine smells like a skunk. <laughs> Luckily, I don't smell that. All I smell is perfume, so I told her she's good. Yeah, I, I took a French <laughs> bath, so I think we're gonna be okay. <laughs> so we just got here. Didn't take us too long to get here and um, now we really just need to use the bathroom before everything gets started. Gotta pee! <laughs> Look at that, we're inside. This is so awesome. I got my badge and everything. Hi, I haven't vlogged since I came back home, but I'm home, I made it safely. And I am so sorry that I did not vlog a lot from my trip or while I was at YouTube. I was just like taking it all in. All of the sites that Cora and Mikey took me to the whole YouTube Creator Day. I was just like in the moment, you know? YouTube Creator Day was awesome. I feel like I look really mad right now, but I promise you I'm not. I'm just kind of tired. But anyway. The whole day was awesome, it was very informative, it was great to meet other YouTubers and just experience YouTube in real life. Oh, that icebreaker was not as bad as I thought it was going to be. As I mentioned earlier in this video, I was feeling very anxious about it because icebreakers make me very uncomfortable and awkward and it's not a good look. But this one was cool. It wasn't as bad as I thought. and. Yeah, <laughs> so I was just psyching myself up for nothing. I got to spend time with Cora and her husband Mikey. They were wonderful to let me crash at their place and it was nice just to hang out. They showed me around the city, we ate some really great food, I had Pete's coffee for the first time. So I got back home Friday evening. I immediately filmed a video that is on my channel now. It's all about love with food which I can show you guys because it's right over here. Within each box is this amazing array of natural, organic, non-GMO, vegan, gluten-free, all of those healthy things in snack form. So you get this box delivered to your door and they send you all these wonderful snacks to try every month as something different. This is the really cool part. For every box that is sold, a meal is donated to a food bank. When they approached me to work with them, I had to say yes because the cause that they are contributing to is wonderful. So many people in America are hungry. So many children in particularly don't have enough food on the table. They aren't fed breakfast until they go to school in the morning or maybe uh, breakfast and lunch at school is their only meal so to know that you are not only doing good for your body by eating these healthy snacks but doing good in helping someone else eat is a wonderful wonderful thing I will have a link to the video that I made about this box in the description box below um, there's also a link to get your first box for free all you have to do is pay two dollars shipping so I will have all that stuff below now I need to wash the dishes I'm gonna get out some chicken to thaw because I'm gonna make some jambalaya later from the box, not from scratch. <laughs> I wish I could do it from scratch. And prepare for DC to get home because he went on a caffeine trip. We haven't seen each other since Wednesday. I left for the Bay on Wednesday and by the time I got back to Fresno, he was already up on his way to the mountains. So. I really miss him, but I'm looking forward to seeing him. This is like a skill. This is an art. Uh, do you want me to show you how yeah, to roll up sleeves? Yeah, let's give a tutorial. A tutorial. <laughs> how to roll up sleeves in a fashionable manner. What you want to do is 